Hello, everybody. This is Dan Clauser, president of the Big Vision Foundation. Joined today in left field of Charlie Wagner Field with Zach Schneider, one of our alumni. Zach, thanks for joining us. Appreciate it, Dan. Glad to be here. Zach, you're currently living in Atlanta, up here uh, visiting. What uh, what brings you to town this week? Well, um, I do have a friend's wedding, but the main reason I came here uh, was for the opening ceremonies of Charlie Wagner Field. I, I knew I had to be here, uh, part of Berkshire for well over a decade, and uh, I, I've been watching the updates daily, and, and I knew I wanted to come out here and, and get a glimpse of it firsthand. Thanks. Now that uh, from seeing the YouTube updates and actually seeing it in real life, I mean, what uh, what difference has it made? It, it, it's, it's beautiful. I, I mean, I know when I was on the travel team, we would have to travel down to Atlanta, ironically, where I'm, I'm currently living to uh, play at East Cobb when they had a similar setup to to this complex and it was a once a year experience and now you have uh you know hundreds of, of players thousands of players coming out you know playing on the the type of facility that they have down there on a you know daily basis thanks so as you come in the main entrance there walk through the the walkway seeing the retaining wall and coming into the facility i know the first year that we went down to east cobb it was kind of a we were kind of all in awe of that facility do you think uh we're able to accomplish that same thing as players from out of town come in here and see our facility? Absolutely. I mean, down there, I don't know if we, we kind of expected it to be there, um, but now uh, you have play, you know teams coming from all over the nation to Berks County and you know having something that probably, I would say in my eyes, is better than what their facility is. Uh, in, in Reading, Pennsylvania, I think you know uh, everyone's going to be shocked just like we were when we were 18. Thanks. So we got... Uh Kind of went all out with the grass. We got Kentucky bluegrass. They're, they're out here standing on it, walking around. Um, East Cobb actually had Bermuda grass. Um, Kentucky bluegrass actually a little bit more durable, and Bermuda wouldn't actually grow in this climate. But again, I mean, looking at this outfield and and seeing how it's groomed and everything, um, it's going to give a kid a uh, big league feel. Absolutely, yeah. I mean, uh, yeah, East Cobb, they, those their grass there, it, you could see that it, it would wear out. Uh, easier than this this is real thick real real sustainable and i plan on rolling around in it after this video but uh i mean it, it looks just like you know any big league stadium yeah so you uh you and one of our other alumni who we'll be hearing from shortly pete jordan were out here taking some bp um how close did you get to the monster realistically uh i was standing probably 15 feet in front of home plate and i might have hit the base where the concrete is currently uh, it was very humbling, and I heard the workers making fun of me in right center field saying I lost it, and I told them realistically that I never had it. So uh, it, it's much harder to hit a home run here, and uh, I'm going to keep trying as I continue to come back and visit, but I don't think it's going to get any better than it was today. Yeah, definitely uh, the wall is definitely intimidating, um, and to think that Fenway Park is another seven feet higher than that is uh, – and as we're standing here just a few feet in front of it, I mean, it's it's pretty impressive. Um, and like I said, Fenway's seven feet taller, so it kind of gives you some, some newfound respect for those guys that can get it out at, uh, at Fenway. Absolutely, yeah. I, uh, I don't even think in my, my heyday I, I would be able to get close, but uh, it's, it's very humbling, and it's a very cool experience. So. Cool. Well, thanks for coming up to visit us. Um, any last words before we sign off? No, I, I'm just really proud to be a part of the organization and, and see where it's grown from, from, you know, 10, 12 years ago, traveling everywhere, and then now you guys hosting everything. So it's, it's a big accomplishment, and I'm, I'm proud to be a part of it. Thanks again for joining us. As always, check out our YouTube site, Facebook, and our website, bigvisionfoundation.org.